Hey boys, um, so probably no surprises at the end of the year. I'll be hanging them up. Um, you know, I'm still got another three weeks to go, but really loved it. I love you boys, but it's uh, I've got some notes just in case I get lost, boys. But um, yeah, I've, I've loved it. I love you boys, and uh, I feel like I could play till I'm 40, but I know that's not the reality. Um, you know, the body gets a bit. Uh, bit slower as you get older and although I like to think I've still got a little bit left in me I feel like going out with a little bit left in the tank is the right way to go about it and I'm really comfortable with my decision. Um, also the thought of going through another pre-season <laughs> chasing bib chin and cozy around doesn't really sit well with me so um, yeah none of this is possible without all the support I've had over the years. So I'm gonna use this opportunity to thank a few people, so bear with me. Uh, the Essendon Football Club gave me an opportunity to do what I love and play footy. Um, I wasn't touted as a high, highly rated pick. I was a bit of a scrubber from Frankston, mature age pick, um, and you know, probably had no right to pick me, but they took a chance on me. And uh, you know, here I am, I remember, in my first year, I think Matthew Lloyd, like maybe two weeks in, we had a meeting and he, he said how quick his career went. I think he had a 13, 14 year career. And I remember thinking in that meeting, oh, I'm gonna cherish this two year deal, hopefully make some mates, have some fun and play one game so I can sit at the Summy pub and say I played AFL footy. <laughs> um, I would have been wrapped with that. Uh, to think that I'm 13 years in now, I'm 33 years old, and nearly 200 games of a premiership, it's, it's, been, it's nuts. So there's no way I could have dreamt of this. Um, a lot of hard work went into it, but I'll take that over the one game any day of the week. <laughs> to all you boys, <clears throat> I'm gonna miss you guys the most, so much, and just this, hanging out with you guys every day, the locker room banter, the laughs, the hugs, you know, all the wins, those little moments after the wins, they're, they're so special. But even the losses coming in and just working together to get better. And I'm going to even miss that. Um, yeah, the thrills we experience together is like no other. It's a special job. This is a special place. And I've loved that I've just been the smallest part of the culture that we've been trying to build here. Uh, as I said, I'm only a small part, but I'm so proud to be. I'm so proud to be a part of this team, and I love playing footy with you guys every week, and I love showing up to work because it's. I come here with a smile on my face because I just love it. Well, actually, I had a little gag in here. I've missed that. I was going to say I won't miss the time trials and the skin folds, and I might even ring Sol next year to try to get the results just to check in on my fat boys. <laughs> uh, to the backs. I love how tight we are. I love how we're just a team within a team. Um, our standards are driven so high. Uh, we have fun while we do it. We have fun while we do it, but um, as I said, it's just an honor to be next to you boys. And I hope all I've ever wanted is for you guys to look over and know that you've got a bloke you can trust and that it will give you all. Um, so hopefully I've been able to do that. Um, and have a teammate that you've been proud to play with because I'm proud to play with you boys. Melky, where do I start? Um, we've literally been through everything together, mate. Um, I've always had you, you've always had me. You know, footy's given me a lot of mates, but you're genuinely a brother. Um, thank you for everything. Uh, I don't have to second guess my uh, attire for much longer when I walk in the locker room, which I'm rats about. <laughs> Piggy in the Adidas kit. I guess. <laughs> oh, leather jacket pig today. Oh. Anyway, um, every up, every down, you've been there. Calling, phone calls in the car ride home from training. Um, you know, off seasons pulling me out of bed to go to training. Um, you know, when I, even you know when my brother died, and the last thing I wanted to do was to get up and train. But you helped me through that that phase, and I'll never forget that. So thank you, mate. Um, yeah. All right, Goody. Um, 
if you've been a part of my journey from day dot, uh, you know, there's been some fun times along the way. There's been some hard times as well, but thanks for scratching or draining every bit of juice out of this orange because like, there's not much left and you've got the best out of me from the get go. We've uh, got a, you know, we're a good, we've got a good friendship, but um, there's been some hard coaching done at times, but it's only made me a better person and a better player. So I appreciate you backing me in over the years. I appreciate the opportunities that you've given me. Um, getting me to this club has changed my life. It's been the best decision I've ever made. Uh, you, know, you sold me the dream years ago and we sat in a cafe in Melbourne to get me here and I wasn't sure if I wanted to leave, but I did and I'm forever grateful that I've made that decision. Um, I wouldn't be here without you, so um, thank you. Um, thanks for listening. Thanks for everything. Um, it's been one hell of a ride and I'm I'm glad to have done it with you guys and let's let's do something special over the next three weeks. Ta. Yeah, I guess Hibo from uh, from mine, mate. Um, you know, 13 years together. You're right. I saw you walk into the boardroom at Essendon. Uh, ripped jeans, thongs, tipped hair with a bag with pig on it. <laughs> I thought, I've got a wild one here. <laughs> and then to see your transformation, not only as a player, but as a person, to see growth um, through hard times and good times, to have Anthea, two kids, um, just to see, it's just such joy for me to see you grow into the person that you are. Um, so I'm really proud of you for that. Um, I want to thank you for what you've given this footy club. Um, we got you here because you compete unconditionally um, and you've given that. You've, every time you step on the field, you know what you're going to get um, and that's why we trust you so much um, and why your teammates trust you so much and uh, we just love everything you've done. Um, we've still got a few weeks to write the, the next page in it but um, just thank you, mate, for everything you've given our footy club and Thanks, all the best in the future. Thanks, mm -hmm. mate. Bye.